What's good everybody? Welcome to my first video on YouTube and today I'm going to be showing y'all what's behind me, what my shoe collection looking like. Uh, before we hop into this video, I'm telling y'all right now, I'm not trying to stunt, I'm not trying to flex, I'm not trying to do none of that, you know what I'm saying? I'm just a 15 year old kid trying to do this YouTube thing and uh, yeah. All right, the first shoe we got is the blue rare Air Jordan 1s. Um, I got these for my 13th birthday from my mom. And uh, yeah. Next shoe we got is the cool gray 4s. I got these the summer before 10th grade. And you know what I'm saying? These actually set. I'm surprised these actually set in store for like a whole month or two. This is a nice shoe, you know what I'm saying? The yellow pops out a lot. Next shoe we got is the Raw T4s. Uh, shout out my boy Damarian for giving me these. Um, I was supposed to clean it for him, but you know, he let me have them because the shoe doesn't fit him no more. So uh, yeah, he just gave it to me after I cleaned them. Coming to the red side of the shoe rack, we got the Satin Bread 5s. You know, just a clean shoe all around. You know, that red uh, sparkles out, you know what I'm saying? That black speckle all around. You know. Next shoe we got is the Gatorade 6s. I'm actually selling these too because this is a nurse shoe that I regret getting. And uh, yeah, I'm selling these on off -road. You know, hit me up on off -road. I'm putting these up for 120 right now. Next shoe we got is the Cement 10s. Now, in my opinion, this is the cleanest Jordan 10 out there. Uh, shout out my dad for getting me these. And uh, yeah, I got these the summer before ninth grade. Next shoe we got is the UNC 11 Lowe's. Now, this shoe is very special, you know what I'm saying? This is the shoe. This is this shoe right here. It's the shoe that, that started all of this. Before this shoe, I used to wear LeBron 12s and Harachis every day to school until my mom surprised me with these. And then I just started getting shoe after shoe after shoe. Back to the red side. The red 11s. Now, this right here in my opinion, is the best Jordan 11 colorway. It's probably cause I like red and black a lot. I did whatever I had to do to get these shoes, man. Me and my mom woke up at like 10 o'clock. We drove to the mall because the apps on my phone was not working. So I did not win any of those. So I had to go get a raffle ticket at the mall. And then I waited till three o'clock to get these. So, you know what I'm saying? I had to get these. Cause I did not get the Concord 11. Next shoe we got is the Jordan 12 Bordeaux, Bordeaux, whatever you want to call it. Um, I got these my eighth grade year for Christmas. Actually, after this video, I'm actually selling these to somebody for 120. So uh, these will not be in future videos at all. Next shoe we got is the. FIBA 12. I actually got these on GOAT. Shout out to them. Official GOAT. You know what I'm saying? They stamped up all my things. Dang, I got these on GOAT for 200 flat. So, you know, just a clean shoe all around. If you ain't know, I'm a Toronto Raptors fan. And when they won their championship, the championship shirts match with these. So I already have the championship shirt, so I had to get a shoe that matches the shirt. We got the bread 13s. Now, I'm telling you now, I do not like 13s. Yeah, look, it, already, it still got the little wrapping on there, the little sticker. You know, I keep my shoes clean. I just like red and black shoes, as y'all could tell. Next shoe we got, you already know, the G Phasos. I've been having these 
for a year and three days. And this is still white. Look, let me get the other shoe. I take care of my shoes. Y'all need to take care of y'all shoes. Look. I mean, there is people out there that be wearing these every single day and then buying them another pair. I have not bought another pair yet. You know, there's little creases, but not like too much. You can barely tell. And comment down below how you tie your Air Force Ones. Do you have them with the bunny ears? You know what I'm saying? Tied up, you know, comment down below. Next, we got the all black air of tempo. This is really not a special shoe. I mean, I'm showing you this shoe because the other shoe, my sister's dog bit up the laces. I don't really gotta show y'all that much. It's not that special. I'm finna show y'all both of these at the same time because they're basically the same shoe. The old school uh, Vans checkerboard. These really not that special. I got one shoe with the bunny ears or whatever you call this. And then I have the other shoe tied up. And uh, these really my beaters. Next shoe we finna pull out is some LeBron witnesses. All right, you know what I'm saying? The icy bottoms, the silver Nike logo, if it'll focus. Then an all around white shoe. You know, I keep mine clean. The ambassador shoe. So of course it was gonna be cheap, but you know, I always wanted a all white hoop and shoe. So that's why I got these. We got the KD9s. These took a long time for me to break in and get my foot used to, cause KD has a skinny foot, as you can tell. Um, yeah, my foot is fat. Took a long time for me to break in these shoes and get used to it. We got the Kyrie Fives breads. Y'all know I love my breads, as you could tell from my collection. That's a good hoop and shoe all around. To me, it's very comfortable. I have my best performances in these. I had to get a size up in these, but it still feels comfortable. So I'm glad I could still hoop in these. All right, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Go down, like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this. I hope you guys enjoy. And comment down some questions below because next video I'm doing a Q&A. If you want to be in the next video, go comment some questions and I'll answer them. I'm a gangster for rain, no camping. If I tell them to kill, they gon' stamp it. I be thinking for real, I don't panic. You can play